Hey, what's up guys? It's Tim. The Colosseum has been released in Old School RuneScape and Wilderness Updates, all showcased in today's video. We'll start with the Colosseum. Basically, there's 12 waves of monsters you must defeat leading up to the final boss known as Sol Heredet. He'll reward you with the new best in slot accumulator for rangers offensively known as the Quiver. And you know I had to get my hands on it. However, it's not going to be easy. There will be a lot of sacrifice, blood, sweat, and tears. Learning the ropes within the Colosseum. Step one, master the waves so I get to the point where there's supplies left over to battle the boss. Step two, mastering the boss itself. If I can't defeat him, I will not get the quiver. However, lootation that has been added in the game is up for grabs prior to defeating him. You can claim it in lower waves. Some cool stuff to be had. Sunfire set, a new range weapon, Echo Crystal, as a Guardian Boot attachment, and even a pet version of Herida. I will say as a spoiler, I was able to get some lootation, so stick around. Now I'll say I had quite the grind in this place. Progression with anything is key, guys, and if you ever mess up, try your best to assess that mistake so you can minimize it moving forward. That is the philosophy that I followed to be able to complete this thing. Now let's dive into the Colosseum within RuneScape's new expansion, Varlamor. For each wave, you can choose invocations. Personally, I prefer to take Blasphemy, Volatility, Myopia, and Re-Entry into the mix, sometimes Solar Flare. The Manti at Mayhem Invo is also added. So once you've got the flicks down with the Lion, that might be worth taking as well. One thing I learned very early on, even though they have tweaked it, Never take the bees or the doom. I haven't tried the doom yet, but I heard that one's bad. And for the love of Sarah Doman, do not let the kitty boy get you with the claws. That hurt. Ouch. This place is savage. One misclick alone could end your run in here with the damage and precision capable of the monsters within. Sometimes RuneScape servers go down when you're deep into the waves or maybe your internet went out. Who knows? What I know, though, this doesn't matter. What matters is the goal at hand, which is the quiver. And that is what I am getting now. It took me a lot of deaths to finally get used to the waves leading up to the boss. That's step one, remember. Step two, the boss's clockwork. How does it tick? SGS, good idea. No! Bad idea! Bad idea! Bad idea! I should have clicked the square and then attacked. My stupid character ran out. We run for the hills! He's a tank! Please get stuck, please get stuck. No! You cocksucker! Those were some bloopers. Things do get better though, especially when the loot starts rolling in. You see, when I don't have much experience with the boss at this point, if there's any good loot on the roster to be claimed after completion of a wave, I'm all for it. Just like that, Echo Crystal unlocked new collection log looking clean. After taking down this last Javelin Ranger, I was offered some Sunfire Leggings. Wave 7, not too far, and the supplies were looking decent. Again though, this was in the early stage of learning, and at any wave with a bad spawn, I could easily crumble and lose everything. So I claimed it while I could. I look like I have pigeon leggings. They did add in a master clue step requiring the Fortis Salute emote that you need 20k glory within the Colosseum to get. I did unlock the emote, however, since receiving that master step, they've removed it from the masters. Now all you need is the regular salute emote. I've got a boss edit for you guys. The final battle is up ahead. If I had to give a single tip for the boss though, it would simply be learn and keep track of the basic step backs. And most importantly, take your time with them and don't try to rush your damage because that'll be the downfall of you every time. At least it was for me. Patience is key, my child. Spear one, spear one. I don't know what he's doing. Oh my God. What is he doing? What is, oh. This was Timmy's first battle with the boss. 
Let's see how it goes. Fuck! Fuck! Fuck, I panicked when the solar flare hit me. The fucking solar flare just got me, boys. And then he did the attack that I wasn't ready for, the stabbing one. The solar flare fucked me. They, all my attention went to the solar flare. I, did, I was doing good. I was doing so good. I think I almost killed it. Oh, this is this. Oh, that's a, that's the thing that killed me last time. Ah, <sighs> that went terrible. I'm ready! Ready, I think. I'm ready! Ready. Ready, man. I'm ready. Get the Fremenic. Fremenic's coming. The Fremenic's coming. Remember, the Fremenic's coming. This is not cool. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> just, I just don't understand. I just don't understand. I just don't understand. I didn't even remember I had that stupid molten lava thing on, man. I took the tier 3 explosion with the molten lava. I didn't even know that was under me until it was too late. And then I couldn't focus. I, there was a spear too, so I needed a diagonal step. I didn't. I was just panicking from the damage of the molten lava. At least I got a new personal best, I guess. Oh man, that was it. I had so many bruises. No! I have no prayer. <laughs> No, that was pretty good, man. Almost. The restores. If I had some restores, that was good. I did good. I did good. Almost, boys. I did good. I messed up a few times, but the eight, we got the HP down pretty far. Not bad with one restore there. Claps, claps. I, I died, but I'm satisfied with that. Almost, bro.
No fucking way. Finally, man. You guys have no idea. What? Oh, go to the inventory. Yeah. <laughs> I'm done. I'm done, bro. I'm done. I'm done, man. Uh. Let's go. Ah, oh, that was so much harder than it had to be. I said it was harder than it had to be because I legitimately got the boss to a sliver of HP so many times. Greetings, brother. I hear you've brought something for me. Yes, yeah, Shrine of Raylos. I brought you the prestigious quiver, and I need you to bless it for me. I visited you prepared with the 130,000 Sunfire Splinters as well. So be it. I can't believe you had what it takes. Spark Mac, you truly have gone the distance, my son. What's sick about the quiver is it adds another ammo slot, so you can now use two different ammos equipped at once, alongside being the best in slot offensively within old school RuneScape currently, for the ranger in us all. Again, well done, sissy boy. Put it on there. Whoa! It looks like a pigeon in the inventory. Look, see the little beak? It looks like an eagle equipped it. Yo! All right. I like it better than the regular quiver. I guess they're updating the design because the community has gathered. It, it seemed a little uh, little lackluster. They might design it to be a little bit bigger. Yeah, it looks way better, better than the regular quiver for sure. Bro, the regular quiver kind of makes me feel like... It, it's something I get fresh off the Toriel Island. Like, I kill a goblin, I get the goblin mail, and then the next goblin I kill, it's on the ground, and I pick that up. It kind of looks like that kind of thing. Don't, don't think about that too much, though. It's the grind that it represents the Great Coliseum. I do like how the arrows are popping up over my shoulder. It's like the Venator bow. You pull it from the back. Equip the hood. Let's see. I've got a gem on my forehead. E.T. phone home. Pigeon of our Lamar, I've loved taking flight with you. What a wild ride. Yeah, the pleasure's mine. However, I've got to ask, what the fuck did you put in this bird seed? Damn it, what the fuck did you put in this bird seed? <laughs> and a final wrap for this segment, take a look at the rune light tracker for... All of the loot that I've gotten ended with two Echo Crystals and the Sunfire Leggings. The video is not over yet though, viewers. We still have the Wilderness segment. This is a double feature special. Zombie Pirates have been introduced into the game at the existing Chaos Altar. Check out the new bridge too. This being here is going to bring me back to the free to play PK in days where it was extremely active north of the Verak East Bank here in Maltai. You know, when you'd hear a chaos spell or even a death spell, you'd know it's time to run. These guys dropped some pretty good loot according to the wiki. I haven't killed any personally myself yet besides a few. The zombie pirate keys are what we're going to be focusing on in this segment. I'll be buying 1,000 of these keys to see what we get out of the pirate's booty locker. Located east of the Chaos Altar on the eastern shores of the wilderness. Let's open a quick 10 and see what we got. Okay, there's like 10 keys. Made 200k. I bought the keys for roughly 90k each. I paid some of the boys more, maybe 100k. They might be less than the GE now though. So with the 10 keys, I've lost about 800k thus far. What? You get more loot if you're scold? Really? Let's see, is it giving it to us noted now? Oh, it is, it is. It's giving it to us noted. Is that the skull itself or the Avarice Ami equipped? Chat was right with their investigation. Yeah, the Ami, right? Because it does the same thing at revs. It's not really worth rotating between the chests, I don't think, like I do with the gold keys. You could uh, burn them faster. But here, it seems just chilling on one and opening it is working relatively well. Okay, we're going to go all the way down to 900 keys and then we'll see what we got. Once I uh, get to 900, I want to go upstairs. Well, the main deck of the boat and we'll see what's up there. Because I know the boat, you guys know the boat uh, west of Mage Bank. I used to escape there because there's two staircases and you can go up one and it's a... 
you can't move on the right side. So the only way a PKer can attack you is if they run around on the left side. Oh! Fucking motherfucker, Vinny. Vinny, come up to the top with me. Come. Hold me. And never let go. Vinny, in the nights I think about you. All night long. When I can't sleep. The warmth of your arm hair on mine all natural into the night you breathe on me and i hear you i remember the first time you licked my ear low near far wherever vinny is there will be echoes of angel thumps in the twitch chat in the twitch chat not gay i'm glad that they gave the multi scene a little bit of love with the update to the west of the altar there as as much as we all love the solo pkang the multi scene needs love as well try the south's chest Let's rotate to the south chest for Borvac 1. Rotated. Now time to indulge. We're almost done. Give us the scroll. Here, let me explain my escape plan. You see this ladder? I freeze them down here, and then I run and climb up the ladder while they're frozen, and then I escape. There's a fucking delay on the chest. This guy almost specked me out. Oh my god! <laughs> I couldn't eat because of the chest, bro! What the fuck? I think he's done. He didn't bring magician. I gotta go and get some food quick. I still remember back in the day, my real life friend was over for the weekend. We were playing RuneScape. At the time, I had gotten my uh, first computer. It was a desktop Dell with a tube monitor. And he was in the computer room where I used to play RuneScape before I had my own computer. And we were playing and grinding, cutting down trees and fletching them into shafts because that was good money back in the day. We went to the wilderness like over here because there was a lot of trees close together. It was a good spot. He must have collected like 100,000 shafts and he got PK'd. And then he runs upstairs. He's like, I just got PK'd. I lost all the shafts. It's like, what? How did you lose them all? Weren't you banking them as you went? Said, no, I, I died. Someone got me. I think he quit RuneScape after that. The bad thing about these chests is there's a huge delay opening them. So if someone really had, like, they could send it with a max strength, like Torva or something, I would probably be a dead man if they hit. When I click that, I'm locked into opening it. Look at this. See that? See that? You're locked in. Your hands are on the chest. I know I just gave ideas out. I need to hurry. Man, I'm surprised these pirates still have booty for me to loot. I've been in here for a while. 700 keys worth. The hinges on this chest are about to bust off. Whoever developed this thing really needs a pat on the back, engineering-wise. Bro, how rare is this scroll thing? This is insane. I thought it would have gotten this collection log. I kind of really want to get it now. How, how do we know it's 1 in 20k, though, as Jagex came out and said that? Where is that j Oh! What the fuck? Here, here, you can try. Here, you can try. Wait, wait, wait. I was gonna let you- I was- I was gonna let you ax me one time. I wanted to see it. My fucking heart! Oh my god. I gave that idea earlier. I said someone's gonna log in with 1 HP underneath me with DH. 7. Countdown. 6. 5. 4. 3. 2. And my last key. Give us the scroll. Oh, that's unfortunate. 1,000 keys have been burned. Let's go to the main deck. Guys, guesses on how much loot we have from the 1K keys. If you've been watching, you'll kind of have an idea of what the average rate should be. Seems pretty consistent. And see what's in the loot bag. Oh, big bonus, Chris. Jeez. Chris has sent in 5k bits. 
Much love, Chris. Chris gave us the challenge. He said, if you open all five 1K keys and bring 100 mil, I'll give you 5K bits. I've completed the challenge. It was close a couple times, but I have made it. Let's see what's in the bag. 21 million. I paid the boys 75 mil for 750 keys and then a little less for the 250 that I bought on limit. So we've turned 100 million roughly into 21 mil. We'll see what the keys are going for right now. Oh, actually I can't because I'm on limit still. But they're definitely way less than what I paid for sure, I think. And it's gone. A couple of things to note, 706 adamant seeds. Those are the new mithril seeds. These will push you, I think, east instead of west. So PKers nowadays, if they want optimal movement in a bridging situation, I would probably bring both seeds. You can push west when you need to and east if you have the mithril and adamant. He learns keys worth 136k each. This is a sick looking pirate ship as well. This one goes back to RuneScape Origins. And one last key. 1.3 mil. So yeah, the Laren's keys have been in game for a little bit. It looks like you get a little bit closer to your investment there with the average items. The pirate keys are kind of up, up there in price right now, I think, because they're new and people like me go mad and buy 1k for the fuck of it. They'll probably chisel down in value for sure. Since I didn't get the scroll out of the zombie key chest, let's buy one out of the Grand Exchange to demonstrate what it does. It bought for just under 35 mil. You can make out some faded words on the ancient parchment revealing the secrets of teleport negation. Would you like to absorb their power? Oh, would I? Yes, yes, the intelligence. I feel it invigorating without my body. It states here, after studying the document, I'll become immune to the Abyssal Demon and Elder Chaos Druid teleportation attacks. You'll notice Dead String next to me bouncing around like I would be previously to absorbing the new scroll's intelligence. Now you can chill and look the Abyssal Demon in the eye sockets as you take him down for those Abyssal Whips. I didn't get one, by the way. How about the Druids? These guys will TB you. It will not protect you from that. Same thing with the Druids. I guess they did teleport you around, even though I don't really remember that. My feet are locked to the ground where I have clicked, and now I'm punching some zombies. I let the Chaos Altar take me down until we return with the tribe for some PKing. There's a level 79. Fuck that nerd up. 62 the north. It's clear, a lot of low levels. Keep pushing through. Level 125 coming in. Target down. Good, good, good. Sardom's with us. Get off. No, guys, make sure you're in the FC. No, Sarm was in the clan. He, he, uh, he must have uh, forgotten to join the FC. Shoot, guys, make sure you're in the FC, FC, okay? Level 50. Oh my god, 122 in bank. There's another one south. Get him, boys, get him. Target down, get the other dude. Get on BB. Nice. Everyone, let's log south, actually. That's a better spot. Let's log in. Let's stay south, guys. Let's stay south down here. We got 112 northbound. Nice spear, bro. Nice magsim. Noobs. <laughs> We're on top of the world, brothers. Oh, sorry. Sorry, brother. Everyone look at the camera. They really crashed this bow, huh? It's roll out. You guys got to check out the new pirate ship. Now we got to go kill some guys with the keys. We got a 120. And a 112. He's back for more. Southeast, 121. He's almost at the bridge. He's down. Cleared. Good job, boys. Whoa, look at all that loot on the ground. Rune Mace and Addy, that's like 30k over there. Does anyone have does anyone want that? We got one. 126. He's got dins. I'm gonna spear him for you guys. Kill him right here. Spear him to Narnia! Spec him out, luck! There we go. Um, no one. Clear. 
Go to the north side and we'll hop. Stay on north. Northeast of 97 and Mystic, he logged. Most of us can't get these lower levels. The Ellie Pier would be a good account to PK here with, because I could hit the almost max guys and lower levels. On the south side, can we get freeze? We got one. Chosen Goose. Someone freeze, someone freeze. Oh my god, someone freeze him. We got no nothing but bolters! Bolt him to death, boys! This guy's chasing with his team all. I got two specs! Get him, brother! Get him! Looks clear. We'll hop on the north. Or south if you're down there, wherever. North! North! There's kids! Get up here! It's a team of 80s. They're all level 80s. They also updated the Wilderness Agility course and showed it some love. You can now make some cheddar running laps. Just got to bring 150k to pop in the dispenser. We did get some action here as well. Yeah. <laughs> yes! Good shit! Yeah, it's right, man. Let's go! I got to get his key. Cover me. Cover me, cover me. I got his key. The other's got to be low on food. I gotta get this guy, he's got keys. Remember, Timmy's trying the stretch client, okay? And the new DPI, so my clicks are in training. Don't break it, he can't cut the web! He has nothing to cut the web with! Don't cut the web, boys! He's still trying to slash <laughs> Got him! Oh my god, the bank loots! The bank loots! Get inside, boys, get inside! Damn, boy. Hey, buddy, you gonna split that? Hell yeah. Guys, you better get at least one of these D-Longs, I swear. I think you can put stuff on this counter too, right? Oh, you can. You guys wanna try for a couple whips and a fury real fast? See who has the quick hands. It's time to eat. Pid test, indeed. I used to think when I was a noob, I was like, if I click faster, I'll get the loot. No, there's always been some kind of pid. It's just, uh been different over the years a lot of the harvesters seem to keep their risks to a minimum but some were an ultimate tank here look at this guy with his ellie and toxic staff took a little bit for us to take him down two mil loo, not too bad you know sometimes the general goes down leading the tribe to greatness i perished valiantly times like this you must go to the bank and gear up in another return set and that's exactly what i did damn they got a lot in there Okay, everyone, everyone, get ready to attack. Attack now, attack now. Attack now. <laughs> Barrage the fuck out of him. Big clump on an illusion. Keep rubber banding. Got one, get on Andy, Andy frozen. Get that guy, get that guy. Barrage the fuck out of these pussy. <laughs> Get him, boys! Get him! Bro's on Andy! He's going down! Fuck him up! Don't run in! Stay back with us! Don't run into them! Stay back with us! Pray mage if you're back here. They're all barraging with dehydes on. Shit, I'm out of food. Abort mission, brothers. We're all... Everyone abort mission. Run to the trees! Save yourselves! Save yourselves! Run for the hills, brothers! Oh my god, my bank's full again. That was a fun battle. <laughs> I, was, I was sitting there playing with summer pies. East, we got a team. Come. Please be TB'd. Gion King. He's TB'd. Ooh, headshot. Oh, 13 mil kill! Oh my god! I gotta go get this key! I think I got his AGS! Keep killing him, boys! Keep killing him! We're clearing him! AGS! I'm coming back! This was a late night sesh with you guys on stream. PK'd for about three hours, and it, we all had a blast. We'll run it back soon over on my Twitch. 
twitch.tv forward slash sparkmac. Link in the description. Yo, it's your boy, the Shrine of Raylos. Have you liked the video? You should. Did you enjoy? You made it all the way to the end. That's got to mean something. Thanks for watching.